Cherokee 7428, Romeo, traffic Cessna approaching right short base. Follow Cessna on go southwest, no delay, cliff takeoff 17. Cliff takeoff, runway 17, no delay, southwest, departure to right, Romeo. Cessna 06, Tangle number 2, you follow Cessna on short right base, 2 miles south, you're running 17, clear the land. Number 2, uh, looking for that traffic, uh, runway 17, clear the land, 06, Tangle. Tower Skyhawk 1672 is holding short 17, uh, requesting short approach. All right, so full power. Hold short runway 17. Hold short. Power is available for takeoff airspeed and cares live. 556 November Delta, am I making left or right traffic? So 6 November Delta, making right traffic. Right traffic, 556 November Delta. Off ground, maintain 85 on climb out. Thousand feet turn heading two five zero narrows one departure. Largo zero zero two left downwind departure. Actually, uh, disregard that. Hold short. Okay, we're all short zero zero two. Says four three Romeo left Alpha two in contact ground. Roger left at Alpha two for ground four three Romeo. Says four four Papa continue downwind. We will continue down with 6044 Papa. Come with the hours at the 520 Papa Lima, two miles from Petki, RNAV 17 full stop. So it's 520 Papa Lima, come to our report final approach fix. Report final approach fix, zero Papa Lima. By turn 250. Standard rate on the turn. By simulating instrument conditions. Even though it's a beautiful VFR day. And on heading 250, approach would, would then uh, give us our assigned heading. In this case, they would say direct Olympia V Awards. What we're going to do, and yeah, we're going to simulate that ATC medication. Two five zero all now. One thousand seven hundred. Says so four four Papa, right base approved. One seven clear, touch and go. Right base uh, for one seven touch and go. Six or four four Papa. So six move Delta, continue down one. Six seven move Delta, uh, continuing down one. Come with tower, five two zero Papa Lima, Tetsky. So five two zero Papa Lima, Roger, continue your approach. Continue approach, zero Papa Lima. So left turn two zero two. Left off two and contact ground. Left Dead right turn to the left. So zero six tango, you're broken. Turn left alpha two and contact ground. Left alpha two, contact ground zero six tango. Vargas zero zero two, left downwind departure north. Only one seven cliff takeoff. Left downwind departure cliff takeoff. What's up, Vargas zero zero two? Okay, direct. So zero pop limit number two. You follow system mile final. Only one seven for the for the land. For the land one seven number two. Look up that traffic zero pop. Two thousand three hundred. So six number number three. You follow system at gig harbor. Only one seven for the land. 556 over Delta, clear to land. Uh, number three, one one seven. Tacoma Tower, good afternoon. Pilates, Tools of with you eight mi uh, seven miles now to the west of uh, 2000. We have a zero for landing. Pilates 800, Bravo Jewett, Tacoma Tower, Roger. Uh, proceed towards Gig Harbor for a straight in run 117. You're going to be following Cessna at uh, approaching Gig Harbor. Thanks, sir. Direct Gig Harbor, looking for that traffic uh, for the straight in 178 of Bravo 2. 2,700, climbing 4,500. Everything is looking good. Engine instruments are in the green. Everything's doing what it's supposed to. I'll probably make a couple of ham radio contacts once I reach cruise altitude, uh, but I am going to concentrate the lion's share of my effort on the instrument procedure going into uh, Toledo Airport today. So we're going to be doing a procedure turn after Winlow intersection Tower six, zero, and then uh, come back in for a landing on runway zero 06. We're going to take a look at the winds down there and make sure that uh, zero 06 is going to work for us. There's 3,100. Sorry about that. No, you cleared the land. Clear the land, 6044 Papa, thank you. So it's the 6th November Delta, tighten it up. 
tightening it up, 600 Delta. A busy day down there in the pattern. Class zero, Bravo Judy, number three, you're going to follow Cessna with Gig Harbor, and a 17, clear the land. Well, I'm your Cessna, number three, clear the land, 178, zero, Bravo Judy. All right, 3,300, 3,400. So it's uh, 44 Papa, turn left Alpha 2 and contact ground. Left Alpha 2, contact ground, 644 Papa, thanks for your help. 3,500,000 to go. There's some clouds up here. I don't know if we're going to be able to quite do what we're planning on. A level off at 3,500 for now. Cloud zero, Bravo Judy. You see traffic. You're, set, you're following. They're just over Safeway, heading to your right. Hey, Bob. We have that traffic inside. Uh, zero, zero, Bravo Judy. Cloud zero, Bravo Judy. You're right. Number three to follow them. They're also a full stop. Thanks, number three to follow them. Uh, eight, zero, zero, Bravo Judy. Okay, we're level three thousand five hundred. That should get us into those clouds that are ahead there. And we'll maintain 3,500 for the entire flight. I don't see a need at this point to climb up to 4,500 since this is just for practice. So the zero pop, leave left alpha two and contact ground. Left Alpha 2, contact ground, Zero Papa Lima. I-5-6, number Delta is on the go. So 6, number Delta, Roger, continue upwind. Continuing upwind, 5 5 6, number Delta. Vargas 002, frequency change for a good day. Descent 3000. Tower, RP1. Descent 3000, Vargas 002, frequency change for a good day. Descent 3000, Vargas 002, frequency change for a good day. Descent 3000, Vargas 002, frequency change for a good day. Get a few bumps here as we come underneath this cloud layer. RB14, Zulu Pop, the coming through, the Cessna goes and And we'll hold 3,000. That'll keep us above the Class Delta airspace at Olympia and uh, just underneath this cloud layer. So we'll maintain that all the way in. There's 3,000. Back to 2,300 RPM. We're tracking VOR number one inbound to the Olympia VOR, and then we're going to track VOR number two outbound direct to the Winlow intersection. Seven point eight to the Olympia VOR, maintaining three thousand. Just looking at this, uh, this is indicating that there's a temporary flight restriction coming up on the 17th. And this could be an air show down at Olympia, so that is not a factor right now. That's what the yellow indicates. When it becomes active, the uh, four flight will display red, indicating an active temporary flight restriction. Then, of course, you would click on that and it would tell you what the uh, altitude restriction is. I believe this one is uh, surface to 9,000 on the 17th.
I think 3,000 is going to work for us on the entire flight. We are 3.7 now from the Olympia VOR. And uh, then we're going to make our turnout on heading 176. I have that tuned into VOR number two. We'll crack that to Winlow intersection. One minute, six seconds. 53 seconds. Left turn, 176. Thirty-five seconds. Twenty seconds. Left turn one seven six. Standard rate right to the left. That's a nice gentle turn. And now we're looking for the needle to center on VOR number two. And we will track that outbound. Thirty two nautical miles to wind low. Hello, CQ, CQ, CQ two meters, Whiskey Seven November Yankee Aeronautical Mobile. Here's a Piper Cherokee on heading one eight zero three thousand feet just south of Olympia Airport. Aeronautical Mobile Station, this is November Romeo 7 Yankee. Whiskey 7 Golf Tango Mike, back to you. Okay, I have a couple of stations in there. November Romeo 7 Yankee, and I think it's a Whiskey 7 Mike Tango Mike, not sure on that. This is W7NY Air Mobile. Um, we're in a Piper Cherokee. Destination airport is Toledo. We're just south of Olympia Airport at uh, 3,000 feet on heading 190. How do you copy? Whiskey 7 November Yankee, Aeronautical Mobile. This is November Romeo 7 Yankee. You got good signal. Whiskey 7 Golf Tango Mike copies Whiskey 7 New York, 5x5. Uh, five five. Sorry about that. Uh, November Romeo 7 Yankee, uh, you, uh, someone doubled with you there. Uh, if you could come back. The name here is Bill Bravo India Lima Lima. Go ahead. Uh, Roger, Roger, Bill. NR7Y uh, operating. November 7. Uh, come again with the call, Bill. November Romeo 7 Yankee. This is Whiskey 7 Norway Yankee Air Mobile. Uh, sorry again. Uh, someone doubled with you. If you could come back. Whiskey 7, November Yankee AM, this is November Romeo 7, Yankee, year 5959, Summit's on the air peak on the Oregon coast. Oh, very cool, Summit's on the air. I've worked a few of you guys. It's never a problem because we're both up high, right? Hi, hi. Uh, yeah, if you didn't copy the name here is Bill, Bravo India Lima Lima, Destination Airport's Toledo. And uh, we're going to be shooting a practice instrument approach into Toledo today. We're going to hold 3,000, stand beneath the cloud layers. This is just for practice. And I uh, thought I would come up and do some two meter operations. Uh, you have a fantastic signal into the airplane, uh, five nine uh, plus, and great audio. What is your elevation uh, on your soda? This is three thousand one hundred feet, pretty even with you as well. And like I said, uh, kind of near the Oregon coast. Um, this uh, peak is called uh, Pinnacle Peak. Awesome, very cool. Okay, I'm gonna uh, just uh, dip, I'm gonna bank a little bit right here. We have another airplane. A little bit of conflicting traffic. I want to make sure I uh, address that, and I'll come right back to you. Okay, it's all good. He's going to be going underneath us. He's 600 feet below us right now. Uh, so we're uh, 24 nautical miles now from the intersection. Now we're going to begin our instrument procedure into uh, Toledo. So uh, anyway, I'm glad to make your contact on your uh, summits on the air. Activation there, fantastic. Uh, yep, we're both about the same altitude, and uh, I hope to run into you again. I will say 73 to you, my friend, and uh, try to work this other station I have here. Good luck with your soda. 
This is Whiskey 7 Norway Yankee. 73, see you later. Uh, Whiskey 7 Golf Tango Mike, W7NY, go ahead. Hello, CQ, 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 two meters. Whiskey 7 November Yankee in Aeronautical Mobile. Here's a Piper Cherokee on heading 185, 3,000 feet southbound uh, landing airport is Toledo. Any station, please. Uh, this is Kilo Bravo 7 India Oscar Golf, KB7 IOG. Cape Garrett in University Place, CN87. Kilo Bravo 7 India Oscar Golf, Whiskey 7 New York Air Mobile. Name here is Bill, Bravo India Lima Lima. Thanks for coming back to me. And uh, you have an absolute fantastic signal into the airplane. How do you copy? Oh, 100%, good copy. I'm in University Place, uh, about 250 feet elevation, using about 50 watts, over. Yeah, awesome. Uh, we're running 25 watts here into a belly-mounted quarter-wave antenna. Uh, the radio is an ICOM 2300. I am recording this flight on uh, GoPro cameras, and I'll be uploading this uh, to YouTube, and you'll be able to hear your QSO on the audio as well as see what we were seeing at the time uh, of our QSO from an underwing camera, and I have a point-of-view camera mounted on me in the cockpit. So uh, I'll make sure I get that to you, as long as your email's good, and QRZ, back to you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's just fine. Well, wonderful. Good signal. You have a good day, a safe flight. Enjoy the weather. Uh, W7 uh, Norway Yankee, KB7 IOG, 7-3. Okay, KB7 IOG, W7NY. Thanks for reaching out to us. You have a good one. 73, see you later. All right, so I ended up having to request a pop-up IFR clearance from Seattle approach due to clouds. I thought I was going to be able to continue the flight in VFR conditions. However, as I got closer to Toledo Airport, conditions would not permit that. So right about in here, I requested a pop-up clearance and received a clearance for the full procedure from Winlow intersection, which is right here. Let's blow that up and take a closer look. So direct Winlow and then uh, procedure turn outbound right here and then we continued inbound on heading 056 uh, to the final approach fix right here at ASACS and then uh, continued that inbound for uh, runway 6 right here. So as the video picks up here you'll see us after we received our pop-up clearance and continue the flight. Now let's take a quick look at the approach plate to see what that procedure looks like. So again, there's the uh, Winlow intersection right there, and then uh, continuing outbound on the procedure turn at Hemzo Waypoint, and then we, re we did a course reversal here, and then inbound on heading 056 degrees. And uh, let's take a look at what that profile looks like. So from Hemzo intersection, uh, descending to above 3,900 by ANAM and then above 3,100 by ASACS, which is the final approach fix right there. Then down to 1,360 by FIFTY and uh, continuing down to runway 6.
And from uh, Hemzo, we're going to descend. Correction from uh, Enum, we're going to descend uh, 3,100. Descending 3,100. Nine miles. Three thousand four hundred. Charlie traffic, Skylake, or Sky RK5 uniform, three to the west, inbound for left downwind, landing north. Charlie. Three thousand three hundred. Three thousand two hundred. And then after ASACS, one thirteen sixty, thirteen sixty. Straight in for El Nam is uh, 800 with one mile visibility. Line air traffic RV 108 Hotel Victor is two miles south of 45 Westbound Runway 2020. Fleet traffic Charkey 7428 Romeo is eight to the west, uh, planning a straight in runway six. Full stop, Toledo. Southeast Rex area traffic, blue helicopter 922 Delta Delta. Uh, parachute operations, Toledo. Uh, we're uh, 1 minute 30 seconds uh, from the runway. We're going to have time to get in underneath your operation. Roger that, no problem. Okay, thanks. Toledo traffic, Cherokee 28, Romeo 3, mile final runway 6, full stop, Toledo. Toledo traffic, 28, Romeo 1, mile final runway 6, full stop, Toledo. Blue and white commuter, scratch that blue and white jump plane, seven miles to the north at 8,000. 
Climbing at 10,000, for parachute operations. Toledo. Toledo traffic, Turkey, two air Romeo is clear the runway.